Think I think you can f f now, but you still got the legs to carry you. Nobody. Nobody brings a fella the size of you unless they're trying to say something they're talking, right, by? Sorry, Mickey. Just give us our money back and you can keep your caravan. Why the f I want a caravan? It's got no f ears. Come on, you boy. You're selling some fight. Oh, my dead body, man. Go on, go on. Matt, have you fight for me? Okay, now, we're going to go. What's happening when you fight? You didn't see them. Give us a damn. You want the money? Hey, you. Yeah. I'll fight you for it. You and me. <laughs> so that's the kind of fight it's going to be. You want to stay down? Let me kick for a puff, you know that? Okay, guys. Get him on the police. Get back down, or you will not be coming up next time. Oh, bollocks, tears. This is sick. I'm out of here. Can I go on anyway, you tick one? You say it till the job's done. Golden brown, texture like sun, lays me down with my mind. She runs throughout the night. No need to fight, never a frown. It turned out that the sweet-talking, tattoo-sporting piker was a gypsy bare-knuckle boxing champion, which makes him harder than a coffin nail. Right now, that's the last thing on Tommy's mind. Cor just doesn't wake up in the next few minutes. Tommy knows he'll be buried with him. Why would the gypsies want to go to the trouble explaining why a man died in their campsite? Not when they can bury the pair of them and just move camp. It's not like they've got social security numbers, is it? Tommy, the tit, is praying. And if he isn't, 